heard a lot of stories that sometimes somebody made it with our passport, but I know that it's not possible. And once I've applied in Barcelona for a master class with the famous Montserrat Caballé, she's my favorite singer, and I didn't make it because we had problems with my passport. It's pity that a democratic country as Spain uh, limits the freedom of movement because of political reasons to a large number of population living in Europe. Um, we understand the implications that might be because of the political situation in Spain, but on the other hand, uh, Spain could easily contribute to uh, exchange of knowledge, exchange of uh, people between uh, Spain and Kosovo and uh, would be through this would be a great contributor into uh, having a making Kosovo more normal society more european society por qué no se reconoce Kosovo pues eso es lo que se debería preguntar a nuestros políticos no qué pasa o qué miedo o por qué puede resultar contraproducente no el reconocer la existencia de una nueva nación en el corazón de Europa ¿no? Yo no soy quien para dar la respuesta a eso, ¿no? pero la verdad es que es un poco incómodo estar aquí y contar de dónde vienes, ¿no? a pesar de que te reciben una hospitalidad magnífica. ¿no? I think, I think it's useless because you know there are other countries that didn't recognize Kosovo, but you can go to them. Uh, Greece is issuing visa for Kosovo, uh, also Slovakia, also Romania, so actually it's only, only Spain. And it's a bit pity because uh, I've been bringing a lot of uh, Spanish films for many years to Kosovo. I like uh, uh, the Spanish cinema very much and I would like to do more, you know, bring more Spanish films here, maybe, maybe bring some Kosovo or Balkan films to Spain. I believe that it's uh, because of their own problem they have with the, with the, with the Basques, with the, with the, uh, the Catalonia region. And uh, I believe that just for political reasons, that's the, that's the reason because I, I hope Spain Spanish people don't hate Kosovo. I I'm sure that's not true. Just to keep in mind that Kosovo is recognized now um, uh, by uh, over nine uh, over 100 countries who are members of the United Nations. And in terms of European Union, out of 28 members, uh, 23 recognize us. So while we respect, uh, of course. Uh, uh, each member state and their di internal dynamics. Uh, we believe that the Kosovo case, as President Atisori, who suggested independence, uh, is a sui generis case and it's a unique case and cannot be used its recognition to uh, create any other uh, uh, ramifications whatsoever. It's pity that uh, we cannot do more because of this, uh, in my opinion, a bit of uh, silly or, or, or un, unnecessary or useless decision of the Spanish government not to issue visa. And I have to stress it once again, Spanish government did issue visa until two or three years ago and then, and then just abruptly decided that uh, they will not uh, issue anymore. I don't know why. So it's sui generis, uh, it is unique, there is nothing, uh, be Catalonia or elsewhere, that is comparable to the case of Kosovo. And uh, we believe uh, that this is uh, uh, the case that was proven internationally as well and that, therefore uh, there should be no concern in that regards of recognition of Kosovo. They should lobby to get to accept to recognize Kosovo passport, maybe find a way to like avoid the problems with, they have with Catalonia uh, through, I don't know, just separate these two problems because it's not the same actually. I think that we need to open borders, we need to interact, we need to work together, we need to show cultures and give from ourselves what we can.